of all YouTubers. This is a written tutorial video and update to my winter word fix found on iPhone 4 and iOS 7. Note this is really meant for developers and themers, not for the average person to make it easier for the average person, also known as the user. Follow the, follow the tutorial that I'll leave in the description of a tool developed by YoRazor185. Follow him on Twitter. Subscribe to him on YouTube. The tool currently only supports a few Cydia apps and Cydia itself. He's currently working on version 1.1 which will support all stock or most applications. Just follow his tutorial if you want it to be easier. Since everyone wanted to know how I managed to get one of working on iOS 7, all devices except ARM64, which is 64-bit uh, um, iDevices such as the iPhone 5S, iPad Air, iPad Mini 2 with Retina Display. The reason why those devices aren't working with Winterboard is because they are 64-bit devices, which one word only works with 32-bit devices as of right now. Um, to continue with my video, anyway, working well, everyone knows how to accept newbies. Sorry, I was typo there. Um, well, to start off, if you need to, you need to be jailbroken with Evasion, untethered, have Cydia Substrate and Preference Letter installed, um, and of course, Winterboard, which does not fully support iOS 7. It's recommended to wait until Sork updates to Winterboard for iOS 7. That way everything can apply or be correctly updated. The video I had previously on my channel was really meant for developers that had an iPhone 4 jailbroken uh, tethered prior to the release of Evasion, uh, i.e. December 22nd of 2013. Uh, the release of Evasion caught everyone off guard. I literally remember posting the video on the night of December 21st, 2013, and watching the semi tether video of an iPhone 4 on iOS 7 via Cool Star Organization on YouTube. Then I watched the fully untethered iOS 6.1.3 through 6.1.5 video from I Hate Snow on YouTube as well. He was showing off, he was showing his iPod Touch 5 on iOS 6.1.3, and was, I was like, sweet, because I couldn't wait for the release so I could jailbreak my friend's old iPod Touches and or iPhone 3GSs and or devices that were still on iOS 6.1.3 to 6.1.5. But anyways, I'm getting off subject. The problem with Winterboard is that it doesn't support, fully support iOS 7. And in iOS 7, Apple has changed the name of certain stock apps, i.e. the bundle identifiers. For example, in iOS 6, the bundle identifier for the default stock passbook app was com.apple.shoebox or com.apple.shoebox with a capital S. I can't exactly remember, but now Apple has actually changed the name of passbook app. Passbook is now com.apple.passbook minus the quotes. So just ch by changing the name of the identifier, you can theme it, but make sure the icon name is also the stock the name of the one found in the stock app. You can find this by opening info.plist on this other stock application. To find this out, add, simply add AFC to add in Cydia and or open, SS, open SSH to gain access to the root file, file system. And simple na simply navigate to system applications folder either in iPhone box or some o other open SSH client. Or you could use iFile to do it. If on iPhone box, just navigate to the stock applications tab on your PC or Mac and click in an app look for the info.plist and make sure you have a plist editor to view the file for the identifier. And you'll see in what name of the four of the theme if on iPhone or, or some SSH client, i.e. Cyberduck or on SCP, navigate to var stash applications.xx. XSX equals numbers, which yours will be different from mine and everybody else's. Is. We'll navigate all the way to until you see a slash, then tap on applicate, tap or click on applications, then tap or click on the app you want to find out the identifier of. I might provide some identifiers for you in the description. If so, I'll update the description. Any other questions on theming, contact me at via ask.fm, Twitter, YouTube, or email me. Twitter at iKilledApple, ask.fm at iKilledApple, YouTube, um, here's my YouTube URL. Uh, email me at iPodNewBeats.
2234 at gmail.com. Thanks, have a nice day. Sorry the video was so long, I was trying to provide an explanation of why I made the video I did in the past. Part 2 is, provide, part two is going to be how to make a theme from scratch with folders and such. And Part 3 will be with that your razors tool. Uh, credits like I killed Apple. This will be in the description as well, not as a download, so you can read it. Do not modify it. Please do not modify it. Um, you can use this on your website if you need it, if you want to. Um, but thanks for watching. Uh, I killed Apple out. Uh, appreciate it.